So my lens just came in for the GoPro that I'm modifying. And it's a vintage lens, and actually, I got the film camera, and it came with the lens, which the lens was the main part. But you see this GoPro that I modified, it's got the sensor, and so I can take this lens off, put that over there. It actually fits perfectly. The thing is, I don't have a mount, so it'll fall off. Unlike today's lenses, where you can zoom in and zoom out, this lens is actually a fixed 13 millimeter lens. So once I get the mount, I'll put it on there. And then, yeah. So I've been modifying this GoPro here. One second, let's get a cap on it right now. I've been modifying it and I've taken the lens, see this, right out of there. And this is the GoPro lens. And it used to be here, you know, with this metal mount and then the cover, but I took the lens out and now I have a sensor, just like the camera I'm taking the video on now. And so what I can do is once I have a mount, I can put all sorts of lenses from the lens I'm using now to professional lenses like Nikon and Canon and Sony. I can also put vintage lenses on it. So I bought some vintage lenses off of eBay and one of the lenses I bought came with the camera. So this is a vintage film camera. See this tiny lens right here? This is super tiny, but it almost fits perfectly on the GoPro when I line it up. Let's see, it's almost perfect. And that footage was actually shot with this GoPro and this lens. I'm gonna get another converter so that I can put my lenses for my Canon camera like this telephoto zoom lens on it. See how long that is? I can put that on a GoPro. I'm gonna show you some footage in another video of, of that, but right now I'm just showing of how I modified it and uh, it's pretty cool. And the cool thing is these old vintage film cameras, they're almost useless if you don't know how to convert film. What I can do is I can use this lens and put it on this GoPro, and now it's a brand new camera. 